I am Dr. Shajil and today I would like to show you how to perform fecal emulsification in a very hard mature cataract nigra case. Now the first step is a two step incision. It, sh it should be well controlled and it will make you other steps the following steps to go smoothly. And now the staining of the anterior capsule with the blue dye and now we have stained the anterior capsule. Now put viscoelastic. The trick of doing such a hard cataract with FICO is that put as much viscoelastic as possible. Now the right uh, side port for the capsular axis and the left side port for the fine irrigation aspiration if needed. And now the most important step, the rate limiting step is a good capsular axis, continuous carminilier capsular axis. Now as we have given the nick uh, due to intracapsular positive pressure, the cortical matter came out. So we stopped the capsular axis, removed that cortex, released that intracapsular high pressure and now continued the capsular axis again. Now you can see I came twice and uh, half of the capsule rexes I have performed with cystotome and now as it was becoming radial so I took the help of uh, utrotta forcep capsule rexes forceps and now with the help of uh, utrotta I have managed to bring the anterior capsule again into my range and now with the cystotome I will complete the capsular access so take your time this is the most important step don't uh, rush during this step because if you will do a large round regular continuous curvilinear capsular access no matter how much hard the case is, you will be able to complete it with ease. Now, hydrodissection and rotation of the nucleus because it's a very hard cataract, so there is not much cortex present. So again, viscoelastic and now with high parameters like uh, 80 FECO power 350 vacuum I am starting the FECO emulsification now making a little bit groove in the center and now trying to do the vertical chop I have little bit cracked the nucleus in the center but it's a very thick very large nucleus and now this is the tilt and chop you can see with the help of a dialer I am dividing it I bury the phaco tip elevate it and with the help of dialer take little chunks of the equator of the lens rotate it and you can see crack it so now though the nucleus is not divided but there are many cracks in it so when you feel that the anterior chamber is getting shallow and the viscoelastic has gone you should put again viscoelastic and then continue the cracking so that is called the tilt and 
chop technique you can see the red the reddish center so it tells us that if the cornea was not healthy I would have straight away done extra capsular cataract extraction without any second thought but the cornea in this case was very good pre-op so I decided to perform the fake emulsification with lot of viscoelastics and high parameters because if you do the same case with 60 or 50 phaco power it will take lot time and it will damage more the corneal endothelium as compared to if you do it on 80 or 90 phaco power now just look at the center of the and that's how like before this case uh, today I performed two phaco emulsifications uh, and they were soft cases and they were done in no time but this this uh, this was a tailor-made case for extra capsular cataract extraction but now we have divided it and we are using as much viscoelastic as possible now we have emulsified half almost more than half of the nucleus now you have to be clear your view should be clear you should know where the posterior capsule is where the anterior capsule is you are not pushing the back too much down the zanules are intact and you are instilling too much viscoelastic so half of the nucleus has been emulsified and the remaining half we are here trying to emulsify it now you can see if you use a very high vacuum then it will not go away like you can see so these are the last few pieces of the very hard cataract so this was the and that's the So here we are loading the foldable intraocular lens and now we are implanting the foldable intraocular lens into the anterior chamber. Now it has unfolded into the anterior chamber so with the help of a dialer we will push it into the bag. So we have successfully performed this hard cataract with phaco emulsification definitely there will be a striate keratopathy but uh, hopefully it will resolve within a week thanks for patient watching